it's just one of those things that you know has come out because it's a big fad and that people are using it and it's wrecking the hotel industry so now our hotels are full of homeless people bc's no no longer got airbnbs is that the next most important thing okay yeah isn't it I, I, I mean, I think that that is something that is rocking their market out there, but I wouldn't know. I haven't yeah. really, I mean, Drop I hear a line in the comments if, complaining. if you guys think that that's something that's going to be a big thing in the market over I there. I got to think it's going to make a Toronto when it difference happened, it for affected a bit. The condo market, but was that the only it thing happened that here? The condo market? Toronto. Remember when the, they changed the Airbnb rules? Yeah, but then they just ban it outright in BC. Like it's gone sure. completely. But, but that's the, a lot of units I'll bet out there. Yeah. Yeah. But I'm no. not uh, well versed in this topic, but I would okay. imagine that if all of those all of a sudden could no longer be rented short term, a lot of the math doesn't make sense anymore. Right. Let's and talk a lot about of those Airbnb. things have to disappear. Yeah. Let's okay. talk about Airbnb. Is it a good service to have? My daughter's living in one at the moment, and it's uh, not the best service ever. I, I used stupid. it once for a cottage, and it was like you got there and it was like, pretty bad and you, you can't really do anything about it i i use it and i think in cities it's the stupidest thing we should all be in hotels where things like make sense i yeah, think that if you want to do short-term for rentals you know you can like you know find somebody through like a private means on a website like you can just google short-term rentals in the area you want and you can find somebody who's doing it but the airbnb model again another one of these tech companies who's probably not making any money i don't know for sure but um it's just one of those things that, you know, has come out because it's a big fad and that people are using it and it's wrecking the hotel industry. So now our hotels are full Wrecked. of homeless people. Yeah. That, right. And and like, the, and the city is paying the hotels all, market rent plus yeah. 10% to house homeless people in hotels while people are paying ridiculously inflated prices because yeah. it's easy to press a button right? You don't even get to see the place. Okay. You don't even get to know the address, like the actual yeah. address. So it's like you get these pictures of a place from God knows when, right? Mm -hmm. Like when it was like at its best and yeah. you get all these promises about the area and the facilities and everything. And then you get there and in your, you're in the hood. Okay. There's <laughs> machine guns going off when you pull up and you know, the place smells no like fish everywhere yeah. and the no pool is closed because it's under renovations yeah. yeah the gym smells it was being like used by piss. like you know drug dealers the week before now somebody's yeah, knocking yeah. on your door again trying to right. find jose i get it and so look if you're not to save 10 here, bucks a night on a hotel hey guys thanks for watching our clips channel why don't you go and check out some more clips we got lots of other good content somewhere over here don't forget to like comment and subscribe boom that was good that was good that was good I like that. That was good.